Can exposure to trichloroethylene, or TCE, increase your risk of Parkinson's disease? Well, a team of researchers for the Journal of Parkinson's Disease, an international team, theorized with their hypothesis paper that there is a link between TCE and developing of Parkinson's, Parkinson's disease. Now, they followed a group of seven individuals who had all had some exposure to TCE and then eventually developed Parkinson's disease. Now, it's circumstantial at best, but beyond uh, TCE's uh, thought link between Parkinson's disease, it's also a known carcinogen and it interferes with developing fetuses. So definitely a chemical you want to stay away from. Uh, it's been used in cleaning supplies and dry cleaning and for degreasing metal parts. Um, when I first read the story, I immediately looked at all my cleaning supplies and everything, but unfortunately, um, it's known to contaminate about a third of the groundwater in the United States. So even if you try to avoid it, a lot of people, you know, can't avoid it. Uh, unfortunately, the EPA has not banned it in the United States. It's been banned in the EU, and uh, two states, Minnesota and New York, have banned it. But uh, these researchers are kind of pushing for a ban um, nationwide and worldwide to protect people from this uh, potential link, link between TCE and Parkinson's disease.